For this every minute on the minute sequence, you are going to be using a mini band. If you don't have a mini band, no problem. Simply perform the same sequence without. What's gonna happen? You're gonna take that band, place it above or below your knees. And then from here, you're gonna start with lateral steps. Step one, step two, step three. Just like so, you're gonna complete that for the amount of reps prescribed. Then you're gonna go down into a squat, about a third of the way down, quarter to a third. From here, you're gonna stay nice and low and you're gonna push out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, performing those lateral abductions. With our abductions, what's gonna happen is knees come in and then we externally rotate. We're gonna have to use lots of glute meat and glute men to make that happen. You can make it harder by stepping wider. Now there's more tension in the band, but if you need to, you just go in a little bit. One, two, three, I might even flare my toes. Four, five, six. And again, you just want to feel it in through the side. When it comes to the mini band of choice, typically for these exercises and these sequences, because we're really trying to focus on building a burn as we go, I tend to go lighter with the mini band that I'm using. What's going to happen? You're going to, if you don't have a mini band, you simply perform those same exercises without. If you don't have a mini, or sorry, What's gonna happen is you're gonna start a timer, perform all of your lateral steps, perform all of your abductions, rest for whatever time you have left for in that minute, and then you repeat the sequence every minute on the minute for the amount of rounds prescribed.